Time. Can I step off? Thinking. Well, as you probably suspect, I have the same problem as many of you. I've been hit by the thinking error instead of displaying the actual weight. So let's try again. I tried everything suggested on the Fitbit site, removing the batteries, reconfiguring the network, but every time it senses for a long time, and just in a minute it'll display thinking. Okay, step off. Thinking, 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 and the error again. So, let's take this thing apart. I did try to file a complaint with Fitbit, but unfortunately it turns out my warranty just expired. So there's, the best thing would be to take it apart ourselves. Okay, I found a pretty good tutorial online from a guy who did manage to fix his Fitbit himself. Apparently this thing has a very good design in terms of uh, features, but then again, the assembly in China is really sloppy. There's a lot of cables which are way too long than they're supposed to be. And some people report that when they took the Fitbit apart, the problem was just a pinched cable. So let's hope it's the same case here. So it's removing the batteries, you need to unscrew two screws. Okay. Just two more turns. It's quite difficult to get these small screws out. Okay. And then you just need to pry the case apart. You need to be very careful not to crack the glass. And also the glass is glued to the plastic piece inside. So you need to be careful to separate the plastic parts. But if you see any glue pulling apart from the plastic and the glass, just stop what you're doing and try in a different place. It's done pretty well. I've got some chopsticks. It's good to use some plastic just to pry it so it doesn't try to snap back together and just work your way around. Okay, just a bit more. easier than taking apart the iPhone. That's what I can say. Disclaimer, I don't take any responsibility if you break your Fitbit. Mine's already broken, so and also it's out of warranty. So it's good as trash anyways. So 
let's take a look. See what I'm talking about? All these cluttered cables. These, these plastic reinforcements that they go across. So there's a lot of opportunities for something to to get pinched. I don't know if you can see this, but this yellow cable here has some broken insulation. Other than that, I don't think this would be what's causing the problem. Let's see where that cable is going. Now it looks like it's just a backlight for the display. Let's, let's get some tape and insulate it anyways. connectors are sitting in place okay that pair these are the wireless antennas but unfortunately it doesn't seem like any of the cables are broken it's also good to move them around because they can have some internal damage some people said they took the scale apart, put it back together and started working. So I'm just moving around the cables, fix the problem. But then again, if this doesn't work, it could be also a problem with the EEPROM. Or something else. Okay, there's a small reset button. Okay, so there's a small hole here, which apparently matches this button. Let's see if anything improved. I don't want to sample the whole thing, just put the batteries back in. version 35 software well we don't want to do the setup let's just try pressing the scale down set the sync step off Unfortunately, this is not it. So the search continues. But I think the problem's more serious. So it's either the software problem, or maybe it's still some of the wiring, but then again, to find this, we need a good electrical meter and check each other wires, or better yet, replace them. So unfortunately, no luck. Okay, it looks like fixed by scale after all. Took it apart again, moved around the cables. It looked like there was a pinch on one of the plastic ribs where the cable sensing the body fat was really thin. So I moved that around and now let's see. Activate, step on. It is taking a measurement.
and looks like it's even uploading to the network. Everything okay? Excellent.